I've been collecting candle toys alongside other toys for, what, half a million years now. They are fairly rare beasts, but just recently there's a huge amount of candles coming out of the design. Studios, and you'll find towards the end of this demonstration of candles, just an extraordinary plethora of clever candle ideas. Some of the very, some of the very, very, very stuff is over here. This one, for instance, is a very clever American novelty for children to have at a birthday party. So if I light the candle, let's see what happens. It's quite a surprise. There's a big spring inside, you see. Wonderful. Turn, t turns to the to the proper lighted candles, of course, and process in wearing perhaps festival white virgins for West or something to white white smoke to white white smoke white white or something to white or something to white smoke and have a little ceremony or something. Shit. That's in the bin. Also in the early days, I came across some electric candles, which, unlike those ones, which are just a steady light, had a bit more subtlety to them. This one, for instance, which is very early electronics, flickers nicely between two the bin. And then another idea where they noticed that, of course, a steady flame doesn't really work. You've got to have something which moves a bit. So this one here, is a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a steady bulb, but it's got a sort of spring to it, which allows the thing to move around a bit, which is quite, really quite shit in... was one in which they added music and this is where chips came in for the first time so in this candle here there is a candle inside and there's a little light sensitive diode and only when you light it will the thing start performing some music hello darkness my old friend I've come to talk with you again Because a vision softly creeping mm, yeah. And it had and it had loads of wizards that had